and changing time has made some positive and drastic changes in society but somewhere still it isn't possible to talk about few topics among them are menstruation and periods women are still not comfortable talking about these subjects and the issues related to it but these are natural and important subjects to know and understand as they deal with human life and their hygiene from scraps of rags to natural materials such as sea sponges women have devised a n number of ways to cope with menstruation currently there are variety of products to choose from right from sanitary napkins veneers tampons and menstrual cups basically period is when a women's body releases tissue it no longer needs this tissue comes from the uterus which is where a baby can develop in the female body every month or so the uterus lining gets thicker to prepare for a fertilized egg if the woman becomes pregnant if the egg doesn't get fertilized that lining is released from body as blood through the vagina this monthly process is called as menstruation or period this is called by the various names sanitary napkin a simply a pad or a menstrual pad and this is an absorbent item used by a woman during their menses and this is to absorb the menstrual products coming out of the vagina and this can be used in various other conditions also like uh, after a vaginal delivery after an abortion after a vaginal surgery history initially how it was developed initially this has been invented by the ben franklin and this was devised to stop the bleeding from the wounded soldiers and this used to uh, soak the blood from the wounds of the soldiers and uh, this would stop bleeding due to pressure effects of the soakage blood and this is how it is developed and this has been used for the letter for the woman and initially in the initial days women used to use a uh, rags of cloth to stop their bleeding initially and later on this uh, disposable pads came I prefer a sanitary pad which is in market. I have tried a cotton cloth so I I would go with what I'm been using which is what the ones we get in the market. Oh uh, no, the pad is better since it absorbs more over time. Any time the sanitary napkins are better because they are they have better they don't leak and uh, they are more hygienic than cloth. So yeah. If you see number of pads used by a woman during their menses. It depends from woman to woman. everybody has their different duration of periods actually period ranges from 2 days to 6 to 7 days this is an average menstrual period and 2 days is also normal 7 days is also normal and everybody has their uh, flow also different someone may have a moderate flow someone may have a heavy flow but the average number of pads used by a woman having a moderate flow is 2 to 4 per day and normally bleeding for a 4 days uh, it would take 8 to 14 number of pads during their menstrual cycle the usage of what kind of feminine hygiene products you use is rarely known if ever discussed yet it's clearly an important topic for every woman out there to know your skin is the largest organ in your body and also the thinnest less than 1/10 of an inch separates your body from potential toxins worse yet your skin is highly permeable especially the skin around the vaginal area not to mention inside the vagina itself this is why attention needs to be paid to the ingredients used in tampons and sanitary pads most items that come in constant contact with your skin will end up in your blood stream and get distributed throughout your body putting chemicals on your skin may actually be worse than eating them when you eat something the enzymes in your saliva and stomach will help them break down and flush out of your body however when chemicals come in contact with your skin they are absorbed straight into the blood stream without filtering of any kind going directly into your delicate organs आपल्याला कॉटन किंवा सॅनिटरी पॅड्स या दोन्हीमध्ये कॉटन यूज केलेलं बेटर राहील कारण पूर्वीच्या काळी ज्या बायका आहेत त्या पाळीमध्ये कपडा साधा कपडा यूज करायच्या दिवसातून तीन ते चार वेळा ते स्वच्छ धुवून सुकून उन्हामध्ये सुकून व्यवस्थित ठेवून परत रिटर्न ते यूज करायच्या त्यामुळे इन्फेक्शनचे चान्सेस बरेचसे कमी होते आजच्या काळाच्या ज्या बायका आहेत त्यांचं कसं धावपळीचं जगणं असतं आणि बराच वेळ थांबावं लागतं किंवा पॅड चेंज करायला काही जणांना वेळ मिळत नाही सहा तास सात तास होऊन जातात 
त्यामध्ये कसं होतं जास्त वेळ पॅड युज केल्यामुळे रॅशेस येण्याची शक्यता असते किंवा कॅन्डिडियसिस इन्फेक्शन होण्याची शक्यता असते त्यामुळे माझं मत असं आहे की त्यांनी बेटर युज कॉटन युज करावा बॅड फॉर द एन्व्हायरमेंट इन ऑल ऑफ दॅट जरा अवेलेबल इन मार्केट अमो हायच नाही रादर दॅन युजिंग अ कॉटन क्लॉथ सॅनिटरी पॅडचे जसे युजेस आहेत तसेच त्याचे साईड इफेक्ट सुद्धा भरपूर आहेत वेगवेगळ्या कंपनीनी वेगवेगळ्या पद्धतीने सॅनिटरी नॅपकिन्स तयार केलेली आहेत काही कंपन्या सॅनिटरी नॅपकिन्स तयार करण्यासाठी कॉटन युज करतात काही जण प्लास्टिक युज करतात त्याच्यामध्ये वेगवेगळ्या प्रकारची रसायने असतात आणि आजकालच्या जगामध्ये धावपळीचं युग असल्यामुळं ते सॅनिटरी नॅपकिन प्रत्येक दोन तीन तासाला चेंज करणं शक्य होत नाही मग अशा रसायनांचा म्हणजे त्यात जे रसायन वापरलेलं असतं त्याचा साईड इफेक्ट होतो साईड इफेक्ट म्हणजे काय होतं नेमकं की जांगेमध्ये रॅशेस येतात व जायनाच्या तिथं इचिंग होतं व्हाईट डिस्चार्ज होतो त्याला आणि कॅन्डिडियस सारखं इन्फेक्शन होऊन जातं ऍक्च्युली काय असतं फिमेलमध्ये व जायनामध्ये पीएच लेवल हा जास्त असल्यामुळे ओलसरपणा पण तिथे जास्त असतो आणि समजा आपण व्यवस्थित हायजिन तिथं ठेवलं नसेल तर तिथं लवकर इन्फेक्शन होण्याची शक्यता जास्त असते नॉन हार्मफुल बॅक्टेरिया ऑन द जेनेटल स्किन ऑफ अ वुमन दॅट मेक्स देअर वे मेक्स देअर वे इन टू द ब्लड स्ट्रीम अँड दिस इज कॉस्ड ड्यू टू द सोप or the stagnant blood available in the uh, soap pads and if it is there for a long time that get infected and uh, a rash kind of things develops and this is caused by a uh, particular bacteria like the staphylococcus aureus or the streptococcus these are the usually commonly found pathogenic organisms and this is more with the disposable ones so other harmful side effects are the allergic rash some kind of skin infection and uh, this is due to the chemical material u- uh, used in the disposable ones and this is not at all uh, with the reusable ones this is due to a uh, chemical irritant dioxin dioxin uh, this is for the uh, this is available in the disposable ones uh, which have a synthetic material some of them contains other harmful chemicals like uh, uh, pc polyethylene पॉलिथिन ग्लायकॉल पीईटी पॉलिथिलीन टेट्राहायड्रो ग्लायकॉल्स दे आर शॉर्ट टर्म्स यूज दीज आर दार्मफुल केमिकल्स दीज आर रिस्पॉन्सिबल फॉर द एलर्जिक रैसेस द वीडियो डेमॉन्स्ट्रेट्स वॉट हैपन्स वेन यू बर्न एन ऑर्गेनिक वर्सेज अ कन्वेन्शनल सैनिटरी पैड द हंड्रेड पर्सेंट ऑर्गेनिक कॉटन पैड बर्न्स स्लो एंड क्लीन लिविंग वर्चुअली नो सॉटी रेसिडव एट ऑल the disposable pad on the other hand with its mostly undisclosed ingredients creates a lot of black smoke and thick residue indications that the pad may contain dioxins synthetic fibers and petrochemical additives in fact according to the research each conventional sanitary pad contains the equivalent of about four plastic bags with everything we know about the hazardous nature of plastic chemicals this alone is cause for concern for example plasticizing chemicals like bpa and bps disturb embryonic development and are linked to heart disease and cancer phthalates which give paper tampon applicators that smooth feel and finish are known to deregulate gene expressions and dthp may lead to multiple organ damage besides crude oil plastics conventional sanitary pads can also contain a myriad of other potentially hazardous ingredients such as odor neutralizers and fragrances Synthetics and plastics also restrict the free flow of air and can trap heat and dampness potentially promoting the growth of yeast and bacteria in your vaginal area the raw material content can slightly vary for different products and for different markets sanitary napkins che jase females varti side effect ahet tase environment madhe pan tache bharpur side effect ahet ते त्याच्यामध्ये जे वापरण्यात येणार असतं रसायन रसायनमध्ये रसायन ते ब्लड शोष करून घेतं असं आपल्याला क्लॉट होतं ब्लड असं दाखवलं जातं पण हे जे मासिक स्त्राव आहे त्याचा एक विशिष्ट प्रकारचा स्मेल असतो मग त्या स्मेलनी रस्त्यावर फिरणारे जे प्राणी असतात उदाहरणार्थ कुत्र असू दे मांजर असू दे ते त्याच्याकडे अट्रॅक्ट होतात ते तोंडामध्ये धरतात आणि त्याचं इन्फेक्शन त्या प्राण्यांना होऊ शकतं
ये तो है ना बेटा कोई भी चीज़ उसका फायदा भी होगा नुकसान भी होगा ते आहे कारण की ऍक्च्युअली बघायला गेलं तर मला त्याचा फायदा म्हणजे मला त्याच्या नाही अलर्जी होते मी माझ्या मुलीला सॅनिटरी पॅड यूज करायला लावते कारण की ते तिच्यासाठी कम्फर्टेबल आय हॅव रेड बट फ्रँकली वी रीड सो मेनी इलेफेक्ट्स ऑफ सो मेनी थिंग्स